Good. I'm thunderclad, my mum calls me James, washing away the garbage, leaving rainbows after rains. So I'm here in the Australian Poetry Hall of Fame. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's play some silly games. Right, coming up tonight from 6.30, about 6.40 probably in Facebook world, we've got the Wednesday Words open mic night here from the Australian Poetry Hall of Fame with a bunch of people coming down to sit around, stand around and deliver you some of their uh, very own poetry that they've written. Um, but first, I'm practising for tonight because I'll be celebrating these two poets here, Rosemary Dobson, um, from, well, born in 19, 1920, died in 2012, and William H. Ogilvy, William Henry Ogilvy. Now, she was born in Australia and died in Australia, William Henry Ogilvy, he was a star, born in Scotland, came out to Australia when he was 20, um, spent 12 years in Australia, wrote poetry, went back to Scotland, died in Scotland at the age of 93, but he still wrote um, some Pretty cool stuff about Australia. So I'm going to read some of their stuff out to you right this very moment, just a little bit, because I've got to practice for tonight. So we'll start with the Australian um, and other verses by William Will H. Ogilvy. And this one's called Sheep Country, and that's where we are up here in Gaira. Sheep Country. Flame of the heather dying. Fires of the bracken lip, winds of October sighing over the gold of it. Clouds on the hill top trailing, shadows caught in the glen. Wahups of the moorland wailing, sorrows of unguessed men. Grey moor gathered beside us, blue moor meeting the sky, high peaks set to guide us, low hills letting us by. Rough-topped grey walls creeping out to the grey skyline, woods and within them sleeping, tasseled in storm-tossed pine. Tracks in the heath around us, only the sheep have trod, nothing to bind or bound us, save the wide skies of God. And that's um, Will H. Ogilvy. All right, the next one. Before I go on to... Um, Redo the cry by Rosemary Dobson. I want to talk to you about this. Yes, the Festival of Small Halls Tour, run by Wood Fortier of Woodford Folk Festival in Queensland, is bringing Karen Lee Andrews and Jutty Smith to a festival of small halls touring around New South Wales between the 9th of February and the 6th of March. From Maluka to Corumba, Frederick, Fredericton, Laguna, Pyre, Goulburn, Dalton, Ganamay, Ganmain, Retreat, Savernaki, Hamala, Brungle, Numeralda, Woodstock, Orange, Currabubula, and Gaira on the 3rd of March, then Agents Hill, Tumina, and Eureka. So get your tickets, go online. And get your tickets for the Festival of Small Halls Tour featuring Karen Lee Andrews and Juzzy Smith for the month of February and the early, early bit of March. And coming here to Gaira at the Australian Poetry Home Hall of Fame, the home to Australian Poetry Archive Library and the Poetry Hall of Fame and Thunderclouds, whose mum calls him James, um, 3rd of March, 7pm here in the biggest venue in all of New England, um, the old Arcadia Theatre. So it's not exactly a small hall, but it's a festival of small halls too. Now, moving right along, Rosemary Dobson's poetry. Here we go. This one's called The Cry. All day I walk in other worlds that intersect and meet in mine. And yet, one part of me I keep in silence, waiting for a sign. I am the innocent, the fool, who listens for a far off time, or feels the breath of evening air, while it is yet the middle noon. All day with diligence I go, 
that pausing at a starry time or very early I may catch the brushing of celestial rhyme as though some marvellous poetry were making in the air above where minds of poets meet and merge into a single cry of love. The Cry by Rosemary Dobson. And this is from her book, Cock Crow. This one was published in 1965 and it's part of our poetry library and archive over here. It's a first edition. Not only that, it's signed by the poetess herself. See? Rosemary Dobson, right there. Okay. And one more before I go. So don't forget to tune in later on tonight for Wednesday Words, Open Mic Poetry, here at the Australian Poetry Hall of Fame in Gaira. And this is a little quatrain, four line poem, stanza I wrote mm, three days ago. The birds in the bush or computer games, the sound of cicadas and campfire flames, beat bleat of a sheep, birds sing, moo of a cow, butterflies, flowers, sunsets, living in the now. And that's it for me now. Here, I'm Thundercloud Barbarian. My mum calls me James. I'll see you later on Wednesday from the Australian Poetry Hall of Fame. Bye.